Alright, so in this problem, we are asked to turn 13 and 2 fifths into a decimal form. So 13, we know, is going to be our whole number, and we're going to have some kind of decimal after it. So we're going to leave the 13 alone, and we'll only pay attention to this 2 fifths. Now, in order to turn 2 fifths into a decimal, we're going to try to manipulate this 5, our denominator, into turning into a fraction, into a, a number that is 100 or 1000 or any of its multiples. So let's multiply 5 by 20, and that will give us 100. Now if we multiply the denominator by 20, we'll multiply the numerator by 20, and we'll get a numerator of 40, 2 times 20. Okay, so now once we have a fraction in this form, we can easily take this 40 and ask ourselves how many, how many zeros we have after the 1, that's 2, and we're going to take this this 40 with a decimal place that's usually we don't write it but it does exist and we'll move our decimal two times we always move the decimal the same amount of numbers the same amount of zeros we have after the one so in this case we have two zeros after the one and so we'll move our decimal place two times to the left so our decimal only for the two fifths is going to be equal to 0 0.40 and now we'll take this 13 and we'll add the decimal to the 13, so it's going to give us 13.40. And that will be our final answer, which is exactly equivalent to 13 over 2 fifths.